America was like that. And then there's a few things. I mean, one was the, the hippie movement, the tie dyes, and then she came to the park also. So you need most of this like, relaxed idea of what the sports were. Yes, um, I wanted to explore this idea what American looks like, what Americana looks like, who does America belong to. You know, for me, as an immigrant that came here almost 20 years ago and my, started my brand 10 years back, you know, this country has, I came here to chase the American dream of hope, of possibility and, you know, knowing no one and I came here and um, made a career, you know, the, I mean, I've got miles to go, but still, like, and I feel, you know, I. I've been able to contribute to the American economy by making like almost 80, 90 percent of the clothes in New York and employing people here. So, you know, I was recently in a meeting questioned and challenged about um, when I said, you know, I want to define new America. They said, but you don't look American. That's what they said. Uh, it, was, it was very clear to me what the implication was. And so it set me thinking about what does America mean? And America to me is some of all things, whether, um, you know, whether it's different um, groups of people, ethnicities, minorities, coming, all, everyone coming together. And that's what um, uh, the America that I came for, you know. Um, and, you know, whether it's Native Americans, the African Americans, who's, who we owe. You know, because of where we are, because it was because of them. So I wanted to celebrate that, and so the collection is all about American sportswear, and it starts with like the white cotton shirts and denim and jeans, and what goes into florals, which is the we chose the rose motif, which is my flower, my favorite flower, and also America's national flower. You know, and we wanted to celebrate that. It's a bouquet of flowers welcoming different kinds of people in this world, in this country, and it ends with these like evening gowns, which is also an American tradition. Like, and I feel like where you know, if you think about the museums and arts and everything, a lot of them have been uh, supported by all these charities and galas. And so it's a big part of it. So you know, where there's a pragmatism of, I would say, t-shirts and jeans, and there's a fantasy and beautiful glamour of the evening wear. So I wanted to marry those two and really question, who does this country belong to? So I wanted to question that because I came here almost 20 years ago. Is it a video or is it a
Somebody keep telling me.